Hello everybody, SCP Slayer here, and welcome to Zucosis. Now, I'm sure most of you know what, the f what this game is. Uh, apparently it's been received in many different ways. A lot of people like it, a lot of people hate it. it it's weird, it's got a mixed review right now. I don't know, I don't know. Uh, apparently it's 1991? In September? Okay. Well, uh, we're gonna, we're gonna find out of this place. So yeah, uh, I don't, I don't think this requires any, uh, introduction other than, for those of you who don't know what the hell this is, um, basically you're working as a zookeeper, maintaining the animals, and there's something wrong. Something is off. That is the best description I will give. So, without further ado, let's go, new game. Gosh, I've wanted to play this game for so long. I finally get to. Ooh. Before we begin, I want you to put down your scribble. Put down my scribble on what? Non-disclosure agreement for Night Zookeeper of Pine Valley Zoo. Definition of confidential information. Any information obtained by the Night Zookeeper during his employment is considered confidential. Non-disclosure obligations. The zoo Night Zookeeper undertakes... Uh, not to disclose confidential information to third parties during or after termination of employment. Limitation of obligations. In the event of injury or death, the night zookeeper, while performing work duties, the employer is not liable for his to his relatives or other lawful representatives. Uh, term of agreement effective upon signing and it's going to waste time here. You'll be sitting here all night and I've got more important things to attend to. So he's, he's going to say things. So I'm curious if he's going to say more, but also uh dispute resolution. The night zookeeper had, or his lawful representatives agree not to involve the police or other law enforcement agencies regarding death, injury, or other events occurring during work, what? <laughs> At Pine Valley Zoo. Any dis dispute shall be resolved through negotiations before resorting to legal action. Now, other conditions. Any changes to the agreement require written consent from both parties. I see. And where he's Oliver Met Metziger... And I am Paul Connolly, it would seem. So, this All is... Right. I didn't want to do this, but it seems I have to. Listen. Hello, you breached the emergency suicide helpline. What the fuck? How can we help you? I... I got nothing. Uh, I've been unemployed for a year. I lost my house. My money is gone. No life. My family. Damn it. I, I just can't face them. Lily, Gina, they're great. They're too good for me. I'm. I'm just a stupid failure. What? Where did you get this? Chill, Paul. No need to break the nose of a man ready to solve your problems. All the problems, Paul. With the house, with the money, and even with the expensive treatment for little Gina. Well, what the do you fuck? say? You ready to sign? That's disturbing. Why did he have that? I, I guess I guess I'll sign. Uh, what the fuck? You made the right move. Just a couple more things, and you'll pull your family out of poverty. I really hope so. Attach this to your chest. Our scientists require us to do this to see everything that happens in the enclosures. Scientists? I thought this was a zoo. True. Never thought that the smart Alex belong right in the zoo? <laughs> Hope you've got the joke. Excellent. Now let's get started. First, grab your personal PDA. It's necessary for interacting with all the work objects. Congratulations, you've taken the first step to becoming a part of our close-knit zoo family. Wait, what's this for? He'll find out later. Oh, the fuck? What did we just get injected with? 
Also, how does this guy? How did this guy get a phone recording from the helpline? Like that's confidential information that they're not. Oh, they don't share. Awake. Good. Get up. It's time to get to work. What the hell? What did you do to me? I took care of your health. Working with animals requires prevention. You wouldn't want to bring some kind of infection home, would you? By the way, I took your phone as well. I'll return it in the morning after the shift. So I got the job? I thought we had an interview. My wife is waiting for me outside. The job will be yours if you make it through the night. Let's go. I still have a lot to show you. Okay, we got some weird desync. I think that's because my frame rate's being weird. Hold on. Do I need to bring down the graphics, maybe? It doesn't feel like there's too much lag. Oh, e. Oh, there's. <laughs> what the fuck is this? Why is there a box? I also like how this is all being shown through the body cam. So, so, so it's like body cam footage. Who are we actually then? Because if we're watching the body cam footage, we are not this person. At least, you know, the one who's seeing this is not this person. Who's watching this? I have many questions. Where the fuck are we? What is over here? I'll be right with you in a minute, you weird old man. I don't know where the fuck we are, but... It's like a fucking meat locker of some kind. This is the giant fucking pipe. Or wire that just goes across the entire top. That is a giant blast door. Yep, this is our Herbs, vegetables, and fish while the meat gets ground into portions for the animal rations. And right now we're running low on herbs and vegetables. Got the hint? Get to it. You can find the instructions in your PDA. Oh. Uh, load two herbal, one vegetable bricks into the brick troll. I have things, access, and notes. There's a lot of slots for things. All right, tab to close. My time is not infinite. Okay, wait. How many? Two herbal, one vegetable. Okay, here's a veggie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shut the fuck up. You might be your boss, but you're kind of an asshole right now. I didn't put up with. The Most of the bricks will be left as a reserve, and take these ones with you. It's time to show you our workhorse. Your workhorse. Oh, I'm gonna have a look. There's fish and meat over here. There's only one brick of meat. Also, weirdly enough, there's only there's levers for each of them. Does this give both meat and fish? I'm confused. Anyway, <sighs> grab the trolley. What the fuck was that? What was that? There's something in the works that you're not ready. Let's start with the basics. And here's our KATI. Okay. Kinetic automated transport with innovative Oh, does that door close when this pulled away? Okay, Katie. I will treat her nice then if she's gonna take me around the fucking zoo. This is the refrigeration compartment. You need to load the brick trolley here. Until you load it here, Katie won't budge. To load the brick trolley, you need to act. I was gonna say the fucking yellow lever with the bright ass words brick trolley written on it. That was smoothly animated, Jesus. Okay, hold on. There's is there motion blur? Let's see if that helps with anything. Okay, you want me to do what? I do have limits to my patience. You want me to go? Oh, you want me to go to the draft thing? I can't interact with any of these. Where's the? Oh, this. Ah. Okay. Oh, I can move. I can move while this is happening. Ooh. 
That's the zoo or is that the town? I can't tell. Oh. Loading screen. I see. Oh. I'm somehow in here now. The giraffe station. Now listen carefully. I won't repeat it twice. This is our mobile veterinary station. Here you'll be mixing medications for our animals. Mm -hmm. Are they sick? Well, they can be. We need to closely monitor the health of the animals. We have some quite rare specimens, so the thought of anything happening to them is out of the question. Take this seriously, and we should all be safe for another day. Follow safe me. for another day is concerning. This is our kitchen factory. Oh. To collect feces like. for tests, you have to feed the animal its favorite food. Here's where you'll prepare it. Choose the recipe from the list. Cut, mix, and you're done. Any questions? Yes. Yes, many. Yes. The zoo needs those who aren't afraid to ask. But even more so, it needs those who find answers themselves. Is that a hint? Right, enough chit-chat. Go to the cutting table. Prepare food for the giraffe. All right. Notes. Treating animals. It seems the job is harder than I thought. Do I have to make some meds? Oh, so I, I'm gonna I'm just gonna check that more often because that seems interesting. There's notes on everything. You need to select the giraffe from the list. Okay, giraffe. Uh, press the cook button to go to the slicing screen. Cook. Uh, click the cut button to slice er to slice herbs. Don't make a mistake with the weight. The exact measurement is displayed on the weight indicator. Measure carefully. Okay, so I have to cut this. Do I need it on which side of the line do I need it on? Oh wait, there's a little drop door here, and there's a little hatch that comes up through here. So I'm assuming that it's going to drop what I'm cutting off here. Okay, so I need 3.5, and I have 6. So around here. Nice, 3.2. What do you mean herbal? This is the veggie. Okay, I need 1.5. So, let me see. This would be in thirds. So, here? I think that's right. Oh, just, that's, mm. That one's a little tricky. Now activate the lever to lower the gadget trolley. Oh, does that door not open until I lower the gadget trolley? What the hell is this, anyway? Lots of things on it. Now drag the trolley to the gates. Now drag the trolley to the gates. Can I not push it? Oh, deviation from the recipe. If you deviate too much from the recipe, the animals might get sick. The risk isn't very high but it's best not to break the recipe. I see. Noted. I'll be checking back to that. What the actual fuck was that? What the actual fuck was that? What? You wanna run that one by me again? I never thought a zoo could be organized like this. A train? Trolleys? Yes, Paul, our zoo is quite unique. It's our pride. You don't see anything like it in others. Right. But then why has the zoo been closed for the second year? People say the zoo is going through tough times. How would I know? I'm just a simple man. Clock in and clock out. How long have you been working here? You don't seem to be a simple man, sir. Teach you everything. Come on, move the trolley. Yeah, I'm moving it. I'm moving it. Oh. To open the door, you need to insert your PDA into the enclosure terminal and select Open Enclosure. Hold on. Infection symptoms. Scars. Scars on an animal's body are a mark of disease. Scars. I need to be careful. I need to carefully examine the bodies of the animals for scars. Scars indicate that something is wrong with the animal. Oh. Infection symptom. Zucosis. Zucosis is abnormal behavior seen in captive animals. PDA plays. Zucosis. I have to observe the behavior of animals. Zucosis can manifest itself in strange actions, weird movements, and weird movements of the animals. Uh, something tells me that I have to actually pay attention to the symptoms here. 
Something tells me. I don't know. Maybe, maybe the giant posters on the wall tell me that, but you know. Okay. Open and close. <gasps> they aren't exactly little creatures. They're, gi they're giant giraffes. Okay, so this is the food? Pour the food into the feeding area. Oh, hi. Hello. Hi, Cleo. Hi, Bio. Hi, Poe. Oh, I can pet you. You're pettable. I got an achievement. I don't know what the fuck it is because it didn't pop up, but I got an achievement. Oh, there it is. Okay, I pet the dog. That was the achievement. Okay, I didn't know if there were achievements in this game, so that's actually nice to know that there's, like, a way to tell how far I am in the game to some extent. Are they playing sounds for them? I mean, it makes sense, but also... Damn, so this is the actual zoo. There's an ice cream bar out there. Chairs, all sorts of things. Oh, there's where the sounds are playing. They're playing from that tower. So that's for guests. I don't know why the hell they have that running if the zoo's been closed for so long, but... Was that a meat chunk in there? Is that leftover residue from other feed feedings? There you go, guys, eat up. That is a great animation. That is, like, legitimately how giraffes will eat if the food is low to them. That's actually, co that's actually cool. Also, wait, Q? Oh, I can switch hands! I can put it away and, like, just walk around with nothing in my hands. Oh, that's sick. I love how they have little wooden <laughs> giraffe things. Oh, that's cool. You can walk over the giraffe enclosure. Oh, that's clever. I like that. That's always interesting when you can walk over the enclosures for the animals. Oh, wait, there's a poster. Blood syringe. Come closer to the animal when it's immobile. Collect blood samples. Samples. Put samples in blood collector. Caution. Blood should only be drawn from the animal if it is immobile. How to take blood. Apparently blood can only be taken from an animal that is in a stationary state. Understandable. Understand. What the fuck does this say? I don't know what the fuck this says, but uh... How to dart. Oh, it's about the dart gun. Animals can see when I'm aiming at them. I only... I need to approach them from behind. Oh! Good to know. TIS. Thermal imaging system. Uh, place the gadget in front of the animal. Start measuring temperature. Wait until data is recorded. Caution. Excessive sleep can... Excessive sleep is a sign of illness. Oh. Interesting. I need to keep track of how much the animal sleeps. Excessive sleep is a sign of illness. Do I actually need to pay attention to this? That's actually very cool. Okay, uh, do I... Do I... Put you back? Great. Okay. Now put on the MFE. What's that? Mobile Fecal Extractor. In simpler terms, a shit sucker. You've eaten shit before. <laughs> now you're going to suck it. I don't know. Why do we need all this? <laughs> we need to constantly monitor the health of the animals, and taking excrement for tests is one of your key tasks. A hundred thousand a year, Paul. A hundred thousand fucking American dollars. You just have to collect the shit. <laughs> Come on, Paul. Don't chicken out. Fine. I have your shit sucker. Here, I'll shove it down your fucking throat, asshole. <laughs> you anything else to say to me? No? Fuck you. Okay, where'd they shit? Okay, where's your guys shit? It sounds like I'm stepping at it, but I'm not seeing it. Oh, there. There's some. Collect feces. Ugh. Oh, that, that is... That is how that would work, yep. Okay, suck it up. Suck it up. Task complete. Alright, I got your shit. There we go. Take the TIS. 
to avoid unnecessary questions, it's a thermal imaging system. You can just call it a thermal imager. It's needed to determine the body temperature of our animals. Okay. Good. Now install it and measure the temperature of the giraffes. Okay. Measure temperature of all giraffes. Okay, let's see. Cleo? Ugh, damn it. Of course one of you pissed off and walked away. Oh, one of you is running hot. Poe is running hot. Good job. Now put Found Poe. still lying around on different stations and storage rooms. When you're there, grab those too. Oh! Is there more tools? No, I don't want to... Put. As you can there see, one of the giraffes isn't doing well. We need to make a dart with Temperalax. It's a medication for normalizing the temperature of animals. By the way, it was developed by one of the local eggheads. Interact okay. with the terminal and press the exit enclosure button. Okay, that, that's pretty simple. All right. In the terminal, you can check all the analyses you've yeah, collected in this enclosure. I think I've only collected one thing. Do I have to make some medications too? Well, you studied chemical technology in Indiana. You'll manage. Damn. How do you know all this? Trust me, it's not something worth being surprised about here. But I barely lasted six months there. Got kicked out in the first year. No worries, that should be enough to mix a couple of ingredients following a ready-made formula. <laughs> okay, now that, now that he's shut up. Uh, apparently, scattered gadgets. Probably I will need all these things for work. I wonder what will happen if I apply them not just on animals. Oh. Oh. That's interesting. So there's more things that we can do. There's more tools that we're going to need to find. Record the symptoms. It seems I'll have to manually record the symptoms of zucosis, scars, and mucus. Okay, so... And keep an eye out for zucosis, scars, and mucus. Wait, how the fuck do I find mucus? Is there another poster somewhere that I missed? I don't know, I'll have to look for it. Alright, come on. Oh, there's like a storage room there. Is that where I can find a tool later? Oh, there's another poster that I just walked past. Hold on. Can I, can I stop? Can I get off this? Okay, I guess I'll push it to the end then. <laughs> Once I'm down here, I'll fucking stop by that poster and get it. I might not be able to get off of this thing while I'm pushing it while well, since it's a tutorial. Maybe. Or maybe I just can't get off while I'm pushing it. Who knows? Congratulations, Paul. You've just come closer to success and the well-being of your family. Now, go and load the collected fecal matter into the biomaterial receiver. Don't carry anything into the car. Everything must be sterile. And don't forget to put the shit sucker back in its place. You really like calling it the shit sucker, don't you? I can't blame you. It's funny to say. Shit sucker. Okay. Infection symptom. Mucus. Mucus discharge in animals is a marker of disease. Mucus. So it's... So that's what the UV flashlight is for. Oh, there's a UV flashlight on thing. Uh, I need to monitor the mucus secretions of animals. Uh, the presence of mucus indicates disease. Okay. Good to know, good to know. I'm gonna have to hunt down more gadgets somewhere. I don't know where. But I'm sure I'm gonna have to pay very close attention. Okay, it's a... Oh, it's E. As you say, nothing's popping up, so I'm not sure. There. Shit, sucker has been sucked clean. Doc? Doc, where'd you go? All right, man. Jesus. Why are you so jumpy? Now you need to load the trolley into the train. To do this, press the lever inside the car. Okay, fuck you. Okay. Uh. 
Bring the trolley in. Excellent. Now this is our mobile vet station. To make temporal acts, you need to load the station with enough vials. I did it this time, but in the future you'll have to gather the vials yourself to cook it up. But keep in mind, chum, there are not so many vials. Think twice before using them. Okay. Noted. Noted. Okay, let's see. We have tranquilizer, lethal injection, temporal axe. Okay, uh, click the button to create temporal axe. Yep. Oh, it's a dart. Am I gonna use the dart gun? Perfect. Now take the dart from the dart dispenser. Cool, you've got temporal Thank you. axe. Now load it into the veterinary oh. gun. It's in the gadget trolley. Okay, take the vet gun and load it with temporal axe. Do I have a note on that? Nope, no note. No yet. Okay. Oh, it says R down there. Good. Now the only thing left is to dart the sick giraffe. Noted. Okay, can I can I dart you? Can I dart you instead? Oh wow, it doesn't even let you aim at him. <laughs> okay. That's fair. The sick giraffe, Paul. Be careful. Don't confuse Bo with Po. <laughs> okay, noted. Okay, so I need to shoot Poe, I think? So there's like a gadget somewhere around here. This is interactable. Oh, I guess I can't access that yet. Noted. Okay, I'm not seeing anything. Interact, please. Okay, yeah, we only have two of the things. We're going off very little information. Hello, Cleo. Don't mind me. I should be behind them according to the thing, so... Is that Poe? You're the one that's constantly sleeping a lot. Yeah, it's Poe. Alright. There we go. Nice! I got another achievement for doing that. First patient. Nice. So, now, return to the train. Oh, I pushed the wrong button. Okay, so this is a this is a decent gameplay loop. I'll give it that. Okay, exit enclosure. All right. The fuck was that sound? You want to run that one by me again? That was concerning. Okay, so. So everything went smoothly. Seems like it. I did this for the first time. Hopefully he'll get better soon. Well, don't doubt that. We need to get back to the hub. Okay. I'm assuming that's my job to get us back. Which isn't very hard. Just literally push a button. Ah. Uh, Alright. So this is going to be an interesting game. So we have to figure out the symptoms. Make sure they're sick. Or, I'm assuming make sure they're sick. I know this has something to do with like mutations. Escort me to the exit. It's time to leave you alone with our lovely zoo facilities. Well, these extra bits of info that we can gather, I'm guessing we have to do something. I'm not sure. I don't know what we're gonna do with the extra bits of info. Are they like to confirm that it's sick and not just mutating? Oh, hello. What's in here? What are you? Oh, are you med ingredients? Are you what I'm supposed to be looking for to make meds? Where'd he go? Where, where did he... Oh, there he is. Every zookeeper is entitled to a service car. This one's mine. <laughs> if you perform well tonight, you'll get one in the morning. Ah, yes, a Ferrari is a service car. Should I tell her you're staying here for the night? Keep in mind, I'll lock you in until morning. No problem. I think she'll figure it out and go home soon. As you wish. Good luck, Paul. Don't mess up. Noted! Noted, yes. Noted. Um... And there he goes. Very well animated so far. I got new access, apparently. I got some achievement for that. He would be one of those people that just fucking speeds off in blaring music immediately. Draft station storage room. Gorilla Station Storage Room, Penguin Station Storage Room. 
Oh, I have access to the storage rooms now. Okay, that's useful. Uh, check the next enclosure. Check the enclosure. Feed the animals. Collect the analysis. Measure temperature, measure sound, measure... Submit blood for analysis, submit feces for analysis. Alright. So I'm guessing that's gonna be the game piddle loop now. Hello? Oh, it's wife. Calls, I'm worried. Answer a little sweetheart. Sorry. Didn't hear you right away. Everything's okay. They put me on probation, but I had to start immediately. You should just go home. I'll be back in the morning and tell you everything. Paul, but I saw them lock you up. It's not normal. Yeah, it's just protocol here. They took away my phone and made me sign an NDA. And all I have to do is feed and treat the animals. Oh, uh, and by the way, uh, there's plenty of meat here. I want my girls to finally eat normal food. I'll be right back. Don't go away. Why are we... What? <laughs> okay, so you're going to give her meat from a zoo. That's normally not like meat you'd cook for your family, buddy. A lot of times it's like really shitty types of meat. Oh, great. In order to access it, I need to pull out the brick trolley, don't I? Uh, brick trolley. Come here. I had to grab things anyway. Apparently now I have access to the penguins. So I'm assuming I should grab some fish meat. Oh, there's... Do I have access to fish meat? Oh, I have a note. Good food. I need to give some meat to my wife. We've been eating only prepackaged meals for almost a year now. It's terrible for our little Gina. Okay, first off... Should I give her a fish brick? Frankly, I'd say fish would be the better option here. But I'm gonna put this here. Uh, but apparently I'm gonna give her meat. Just whatever the hell this mystery meat brick is. What is this even? This is very weird looking. It's supposed to be so processed. Here you go, Lily. Have your meat brick. Lily. Are you here? Yeah. Take this. Give Gina a kiss from Daddy. It's time for me to work. Okay, task is complete. Alright. Do I have a note on that task? Nope. Okay, so now we go do our thing. Okay, we have food on the trolley. Uh, I don't know if I'll need more. Though I will probably be coming back often to get more. Let's see, where is... Is there any tools in here? No, there's an axe. Can I use that as a tool? That'd be nice. Okay, let it brick trolley. Alright, let's get going. I'm probably not gonna edit this very much. Uh, for future reference. Um, just because this feels like it's gonna be one of those games that's gonna be more interesting to watch. Mostly unedited. All right, let's see. Uh, can I go back to the drafts? Because I would like to check out that storage unit. I'm going to go back and visit the drafts real quick. We're going to pop in here, check out that storage unit, and then probably piss off. Okay, any random items lying around? No. Now that I'm free of the tutorial section. I don't know what can even be lying around. I don't know, but I want to access this Goddamn storage unit. Oh, hey. What's this? Take note. Bring dart, suit, submit. Uh, stool disorder? Uh, I need to closely monitor the animal's feces. If there's a change in the stool, it indicates disease. Oh, okay. There's a note on the fecal extractor. The fuck? Hello, let me in. Oh, there's something there. Oh. Phone. Phone. Hello? I wasn't expecting this. Night Zookeeper, Paul Connolly. Oh, thank God. Finally. Uh, please don't hang up. I've been trying to reach my husband all day. He's a scientist. Clarence J. Summers. People usually call him CJ. I'm sorry, ma'am. I'm here alone. Please check for me. He should be in the lab. Uh, is there a lab here? Oh, I understand. You're new. 
Then one last request. Look in his locker in the break room. Code 1768. Ma'am, this doesn't feel right. Paul, I'm oh god. You. CJ needs to take his medication regularly. I just want to make sure he has them with him. Just open the locker. That's all. I'll call back. Duh. God, what the hell? I don't know if you guys could hear that. But for some reason, the audio was, like, constantly swapping which ear it was coming in. Oh, hello. More meds. Oh, God. Lots more meds. Okay. Got some more meds. Is there more? Is there a tool sitting around somewhere? Oh, med. Even more meds. Asa. <laughs> Animal sound spectrum analyzer. Uh, come closer to the animal spectrum recording until... Wait until the data's recorded. Alright. That works. Is there a tool just lying around in here now? Okay. That is fair. Alright, let's get going then. Oh, hello. I walked straight past you. Okay, so there is like random shit that spawns in the hallway. Okay. So apparently she wants us to check CJ's locker. I'm assuming that's where all the lockers are. Let's go to the hub. Let's go to the hub and then let's go see the wallabies. I think. I think we're gonna go to the wallabies next. Alright. Uh Open Sesame! Okay, so. Which one of these? Ah, CJ Summers. Oh, I did. Oh, a good thing I I didn't even think about remembering the code. I'm I feel dumb. <laughs> but no, he just does it for me. God, could you imagine if he did, didn't? What the fuck is that? Okay, um, floppy disk and a PDA. CJ Summers. Okay, X. Serious Summers Experiment 23. Uh, testing experimental meds on mutated specimens. They don't work during the frustration phase. Uh, the pathological cell division process must be completed. In order, in other words, the organism must fully mutate. Access to experimental drugs is located at the vet station. Oh. All right. All right, that sounds logical. All right, I guess we're I guess we're going to the Wallabies now. Now that I got that info. Okay. Uh, what do Wallabies eat? I should probably check to make sure I have enough for them while I'm here. Wallabies, 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 Wallaby. Okay, I have enough. All right, well, we'll make it when we get there. Let's go to the Wallabies. Wallaby. Oh. Here I come. All right, let's see. Uh, before we go see the wallabies, let's get the food made. Okay, I have two point eight. I need two grams. So let's say like right about here. Oh, spot fucking on. Hell yes. Okay, so I have 2.1 of this, so about half of this brick. About here. That'd be the one. Fucking spot on. Holy shit. <laughs> oh, that is great. How do I have a 1% deviation? It's fucking perfect. I am God. <laughs> I don't want achievement I got. Food ninja. That's funny. Apparently I'm now the food ninja. So I got something completely perfect. Okay, any gadgets lying around before I continue on? Anything I need to add to the... Oh. Ah, meds. Uh, let's pull our gadget trolley down. Wallaby station. This is interesting. Oh, there's a thing on the TAS. I've already gotten that. Infection symptoms... Oh, there's storage. Okay, before we do that, before we go into the thing, I want to check out the storage room. 
Is there anything in here? Of use? Other than, of course, meds. God, there's a lot of meds. A fucking ton of meds. Grab you. Grab you. I don't even need to access the station via, like, an access door. What the fuck is this? PDA. One of four of this guy's journal, I'm assuming? Anthony Hopwood. Uh, I just saw something horrible. I shot lethal, lethal dart, but it wasn't enough. It took around 300 milliliters, but it worked. Fuck, it worked. I'm alive. That's concerning. Alright, so I'm gonna have to look out for that guy's notes, I'm guessing? Because it said one of four. Wait, where's the fourth one gonna be? Oh, the vet gun. Oh. Is that the thing I couldn't see that was, like, in the shadows? Okay. Well, let's get into the enclosure. Let's see these wallabies. I like wallabies. They have at the zoo. Or the... Well, it's not really a zoo. It's like a... A farm thing that's, like, kind of a zoo. Got all sorts of things. And, oh, my God, wallabies. Hello, Wally. Sally. Amy. Please tell me you all have Y names. Penny, oh my god, yes you do. You're sick. Hopefully not, you know, sick sick, but you're all just cool. Okay, let's just feed you real quick. Do you have food? There's your feed. Perfect for all of you. There we go. God, this is a nice looking enclosure though. I like it. Okay, let's put that there. Let's grab... Grab you. What was that sound? Oh, task is complete. They all ate. Amy, 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 please don't hop away. Okay, I got you. Okay, let's see. Did they leave any tools lying around your fucking enclosure? Could have thought of that. I wouldn't put it past some, like, hide things inside the enclosures. Sally is fine. Ah, here you all are. Oh, one of you is hot. One of you is running hot. Oh, poor Penny. Hi, Penny. Okay, there we go. Okay, I got your temp. Oh, I'm gonna have to watch your behavior. You are napping. I'm gonna have to watch see if you're napping a lot while I'm here. Hi, Sally. Hello. I, I want to pet them. I'll put this away and then I'm gonna go pet them. But first... There is a missing tool from the thing. Hold on. Uh, oh, here's the ASSA thing. Okay, first off, Penny. Penny. Hey, hey. Get pet. We'll get pet. Oh, That animation's a little messed up because it didn't go around the head, but that's fine. Okay, Penny, I'm gonna give you a scan. You seem fine, apparently. I don't know what the fuck this is measuring. Is this measuring your vocal tones or something? What is this measuring, actually? Okay, you seem fine, even though you're somehow lower than the other ones. How the hell does that work? Okay, where's the last one? I know there's one more. It's in here. No? Have we gotten all of you? Got Penny. Ah, Sally, there you are. Hey, girl. I just need to give you a little scan here. Okay, I got you scanned. Now I'm gonna get the poop, gonna get the shit sucker, and probably the blood syringe thing. Probably get that as well. Nope, not that. Not that. I want the shit sucker, not the. There we go. Okay, let's get you guys poops. Did you all poop? I hope y'all pooped. Yeah, that's two, three. There's four of you, so. Okay, now let's just put that away. Let's see if we can get your blood. Can I? No. Oh. Oh, there we go. Oh, you lied down for me? Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's okay. Uh, what, what, what one was that? Was that Amy? Oh, what one are you? I don't remember. Okay, I got Amy's. I got Amy's. There's Penny. Oh, she is napping a lot. She is sick. Oh, and she has scars. Shit. Damn. I should grab the UV and see if she has mucus. Okay, Wally, I haven't gotten yours. 
I got Amy, Penny, and now Wallies. So now I just have Sally I need to get. Oh, that was a weird glitch. I could see two of the thing. Oh. Hey, Wally, I just got you. Penny, I got you. Amy, I got you. Where's Sally? Sally. Here, girl. Where? Sally just likes to hide. That's Wally. There's Sally. Hi, girl. It's okay. There we go. Okay, there we go. Okay, we've got the blood samples. We've got the shit extracted. And I'm going to grab... Where's the UV light? Which one of these is... Ah, oh, this is the UV. Okay, Wally, hello. Hi, do you have mucus secretions in weird spots? No, Penny? Penny, hold still. And have a look at you. Are you secreting mucus? Oh, you do have mucus secretions. I think. Is that what that is on your face? What the fuck? Come here. Hold your fucking horses, Penny. Looks like you're secreting mucus. I can barely see it, though, because you won't hold still. I can switch modes. Oh, you can. This is gonna be a normal flashlight as well. That's nice. All right. So I do have a flashlight, so I can see things. Okay, is there anything I missed in here? No. Hi, Sally. Are you secreting mucus? No. Well, maybe you are. I can't tell. Is that stuff on your face supposed to be there? I'm just gonna assume it's supposed to be there. Okay. Now. Put this away. We have all of our readings. I'm assuming that we have. I haven't seen weird movement, so she doesn't have zucosis. Now, no, put that away. I want to put this here. There we go. She seems to be acting pretty normal. She's not acting erratic. I don't know about her. I don't know about Penny's blood or shit. So we're just gonna. Go make sure we, uh, investigate and see if it's got anything going on with it. Okay, let's get to the train and grab the shit sucker. Put it in here, please. There we go. Ugh, that is still gross. Okay, we got the shit taken care of. Now, do I need to grab the blood thing, or can I just put it in? Okay, there we go. Pass complete! Nice. Okay. So that's all of them. Alright, now I just need to heal the animal. Okay, still nothing new there. But uh, I still don't know where the hell the missing tool from the gadget card is. So, let's see. Uh... Diagnosis. Alright, there's the diagnosis section. Oh, cool. We can look at all of the animals that we've actually got going on. Alright. Symptom map. Do I... Does this do something? Oh, this helps narrow it down. Alright, so... Jet... Oh, Penny has something wrong with her blood and her temperature. Oh, and apparently that's... Irlichia maris? Ericulia maris is a species of bacteria that infects white blood cells and is transmitted by ticks. Okay, so it's bacteria in the bacteria of the blood. Okay, radic radic tier. Oh, do I have to figure it out based off the description? All right. Uh, anthes anthesium substance. For treatment of allergic mal no, that's allergies. Antimicrobial substance for treatment of blood disease. Oh, that might be it. Might be B guard. Etherelex. Antimicrobial substance for treatment of infectious disease caused by, bacter by bacterium. Oh, this, this never mind. This is this is it. It's literally got the name. Alright. I need one dot of this. Thank you very much. Yes, yes, yes. Give me, give me. And gone to the guy that's trolley. This is taking a while. The loop's a little slow. But that is fine by me. Okay, yeah, that is exactly the symptoms. Alright, let's load this up. Let's go shoot ourselves an animal. So far it hasn't, it hasn't hit the horror thing, but I think that's a good thing. 
enough setup without being instantaneously into the into the thing. All right, Penny, there you are. Okay, be behind her. Be behind her. There we go. Gotcha. Okay, next is check next enclosure. I will once I go get more herbs and veggies because uh, I am out. So yeah, next stop, the station. Oh, phone. Phone is going off. Hello? Night Zookeeper, Paul Connolly. I'm sorry, ma'am. I haven't had a chance to look around yet. What do you mean? What's with the ma'am? Oh, nothing. A woman called, looking for someone named CJ, searching for her husband. That bitch again. Although CJ's no saint either, always hanging around some girls, lying to his wife that he's in the lab. And we don't even have labs here. Anyway, forget it. Why am I calling you? There'll be a food delivery soon, and you need to grind some fresh meat. Got it? Yes, sir. Excellent. I'll call you later. Okay. So, we have meat delivery, and apparently CJ is not in the labs? I'm confused. Oh, what the hell? Ugh. Mm, uh, that was disgusting. Alright, so we have something going on with us. Is it what he injected us with? Is that it? Something tells me he did not inject us with something nice. Uh, just a treat, whatever the fuck we have. Uh, have to deal with. Oh, I just realized. Floppy disk with Caesar's, from Caesar's Locker. Alright. Alright, back to the hub. Let's go! Onward! To the hub! Alright, alright, alright. Brick time! Brick trolley out. Okay, I don't know why the hell it says that I have a vegetable brick there still. There is no veggies there. There's, like, less than a kilogram. Gosh. Anyway... Let's just open up the supply thing. I'm assuming that's where we go. It's a... Uh... The fuck? <laughs> I have many, many questions. Um... Hello? Hello? Damn. I, I mean, Night Zookeeper, Paul Connolly. Don't worry, Paul. It's me again. How's it going? Do you need any explanations? Yes, oh, please. I definitely do. I thought you had beef or, uh, I don't know, lamb in the fridge. And there... And there's a long neck pig. You see, Paul, dozens of parasites spread from the mother every day. They infiltrate our animals and they turn into... How shall I put it? Well, monsters. And they have specific tastes. They need meat. Why human? What the hell is the mother? <laughs> Relax. The mother is securely locked away. Not much is known about her, so they study her. Forget about it. You know your tasks. Don't worry about the rest. Fuck! I gave a piece of meat to my wife. You did what? <laughs> Sorry, Paul. But it's really ridiculous. Life gives you a chance to become a worthy, well-off person, and you take the easy way. How is that worthy? A simple theft. How is this worthy? Any more indulgence. So if they say grind bodies, you grind. They'll say kill, you kill. Got it? Got it. Just tell me where my phone is. I'll call Lily. Maybe she and Gina haven't eaten yet. I won't allow it, chum. If you call your wife, it'll be a direct violation of the NDA. No, Paul. You won't drag me into this. You'll have to fully feel the consequences of your misdeed. And now stop whining and go to work. I see. Uh, new access added? Uh, I've given you access to the recipes for infected specimens in the kitchen factory feed them. Oh. Okay. CJ's locker code. Floppy disk data has been accessed. Animal mutation cure recipes. Infection. Infected animal recipes are available. Oh. Okay. Prepare meat. It's the next step, apparently. 
Oh god. Why is she alive? Why- that's fucked. Why is she alive? Jesus Christ, I hear the phone going off. I'm gonna go to the phone. Uh, what the fuck? You wanna explain? Hello? The night zookeeper, Paul Connolly. Why so grim? Problems? Uh, what the hell is going on here? Fuck. I almost threw a live girl into the grinder. Where did she come from? Alive? Well, well. 20 mil of xylosine and she's still with us. But fortunately, what? this problem is easy to solve. Pull the drop lever and the girl will turn into a couple of bricks, just like you've dealt with before. Easy peasy. Fuck! I suspected this place wasn't clean, but uh, why else such big fucks? I can grind a couple of bodies, but I'm not going to get involved in crime and risk my family. Fuck you. Well, no one is asking you. In general, look at your hands. What the hell is this? What the fuck? You poison me? What is that? Poison? <laughs> Who do you think I am? A desperate housewife? No, Paul. <laughs> I infected you. And by the way, I did it for your own good. You see dozens of parasites spread out of the mother every day. They infiltrate our animals and they transform, to put it mildly. Well, let's say they mutate. What the hell is this damn mother? <laughs> Not much is known about her, so they study her. But right now, the same parasite is squirming inside you. And if you behave well, they'll take it out. And if oh. not, who knows? Maybe it will be even better for Lily and Gina. Fuck! Fuck. Okay, um... God, I heard there's multiple entrances, so I'm not sure what the fuck... Are the choices? Oh, this is a choice. Woman lever we're just we're just not gonna look um goodbye sorry but uh we I, I i'm not doing that route right now we're going to see what the hell happens either way i'm probably gonna do multiple runs of this just to see what the hell the actual options are so we got meat bricks yay Ugh, this is this is disturbing on multiple levels. I don't like this. That's probably an entire route. Is interacting with her and probably, I'm guessing, saving her. If I had to guess. Put a meat there. Grab another herbal. And another vegetable. Alright. That should be enough. For the gorillas and or other things now when the hell do i do i feed the mutant creature because said can you access to the recipes for the infected specimens in the kitchen factory feed them. i already you already said that okay um where the fuck should i oh what the hell brick trolley oh not connected oh i forgot to pull the fucking lever i'm dumb that's on me I was gonna leave without my food. That would have been bad. Good thing it doesn't fucking let me. Jesus Christ. <laughs> okay, I have one of everything, so... Gorillas, I go! Also, why the fuck am I going to the gorillas? I'm realizing that that's probably a bad idea. <laughs> Alright, let's get going. Oh. That was interesting. Alright. Task updated. Oh, we have meds. Can I get that one? Is that not a med? Is that not meds? I guess that's not meds. Is there the missing tool around here, maybe? I don't know. Alright, gadget trolley. Oh, no, I bring the gadget trolley back. I just remembered I need to make food. Alright, so I'm at the gorillas. So, I need... Good thing I grabbed more. Okay, so I need one kilogram out of 3.8... Go with about here. One point two. Okay, that's not bad for a deviation. Okay, let's cut the vegetable. Out of a two point five kg out of four, so a little bit over half. Two point one. All right, that's acceptable. Okay, now I can 
fucking pull off the food trolley and all that. And, uh, let's see where the fuck we wind up going. Let's see these gorillas. Will I be able to pet them? I will be able to pet them. That'd be nice. Just see some gorillas. Oh, there's a storage area. We'll have to check out the storage area first. I do not like that sound. Why did I pick gorillas, actually? Wait. <laughs> I picked between penguins and gorillas and picked gorillas. What the hell is wrong with me? <laughs> oh, God. Um, Let's see. That's the TIS. I was, I, was I was wondering if that was, like, the tool that I'm missing. Poster. I have no idea where the hell the tool could be, though. Oh, hello. Meds. Meds. Everything for the meds. I have so much of everything. Oh, hello. There's two of these PDAs in here. Alright. Apparently this is PDA 3, so I'm skipping a one. Uh, when they turn, the meat can calm them down. Oh, that's gonna be important for me to remember, isn't it? That's gonna be very important for me to remember, I can almost guarantee it. PDA. Oh, this is two. Alright. K2. I finally found a way to cure that damn mutant with the experimental meds. I found access on some CJ's PDA. Looks like he's an important dude around here. Gave the mutant an injection of Toxicus Feralus. Uh, and this shit really worked. Awesome news. And by the way, it seems mutants can mimic different diseases. I'll keep an eye on it. Oh. So that's why the three things that I can't track easily are going to be important. Noted. Alright, uh, let's see. I'm kind of scared to open this damn door. Okay, let's just open the door. Hello, Dexter, Thor, Chief, Pepper, I love your names. That is great names. Damn, what is that area out there? I guess you guys have an indoor enclosure. Here's your food. So, that's why we have meat. I was wondering why the hell we have meat, because I don't think I saw a predator on the list of animals. Uh, oh, what I'm throwing up. I'm guessing... I'm guessing they're the sick one. Hi, Pepper. Hi. Hi, girl. Can I pet you? Uh, Chief, are you sick too? Or is one of you faking? Okay, let's just, uh... Let's just start taking some, uh, things. So, first off, temperatures. Thoria, you're fine. Chief. You're fine. Okay, they're all eaten. Okay, Pepper, you're barfing, but you're not... Neither of you are hot, so... I'll have your temperatures. Let's get the other readings. Let's do... I, f I feel like g taking a blood from a gorilla is going to be a bad idea. So let's do that one last. Let's do... Poop collection and sound next. Okay, let's just suck this up. There's one. There's two... Okay, where's the rest of the shit? Uh, there's one. Three. Then, did one of you come over here to poop? Yes, you did. Four. Yes, I thought I saw one of you walk over here after eating. Just meandered over. Alright. Let's put that there. Gotta grab the blood syringe, because that's gonna be next. Alright, let's see. Pepper? How you doing? Auditory-wise, it seemed fine. Hi, Pepper. Okay, let's see. God, you're... Are you supposed to be behaving like that? Chief? Pep Dexter? Pepper? Okay, do you guys have zucosis? Because you're behaving very weirdly. 
Thor. You're fine. Everyone's fine on this. Maybe it's the poop and blood. Okay, Dexter, hi. Don't mind me. I'm just gonna... Take a little bit of blood. Hi. Please don't fucking punt me through the wall. I'm sure that hurt a bit. Chief? Hi. Please quit barfing. Oh god, I'm passing through the other one. I'm gonna give you a little pet. Everything's gonna be okay, big guy. Ugh, that one's barfing in the background. Ugh, I hate it. Okay, Dexter, I already got your blood. Thor, Chief, and Pepper, I need one of you guys to hold still. Please hold still, Thor. Please hold still. One of you hold still. God is loud in here. One of you make this possible on me. Okay, I need to catch you two when you're fucking barfing. Thor, I can get your blood. Yay. Hi. You're fucking nice looking. Are you albino? No, you don't have red eyes. Thank you, buddy. Okay, you guys really don't want me to take your fucking blood. Pepper, I just need your blood. That's all I need. There we go. Okay, there we go. Okay, I just need to hover over them in order to get the fucking blood samples. And when they go to barf, I can... S there we go. Thank you, Chief. Okay, I got the sample. Thank you, guys. You're, you're great patience. Thank you. And... Exit enclosure. Okay, so the last note from that guy, I don't know what the fuck's gonna say. But, uh... I'm not sure which one of them... They're both displaying symptoms of necrosis. I don't see any wounds. Uh, I should have checked for mucus. Hold on. I'm gonna take the UV light. Uh, I don't know why the fuck I just put away the UV light and pulled out that, but... I did. So... Alright. Pepper? Are you... Oh, there's mucus. Okay, Pepper's got some mucus on her. Where's Chief? That right, big guy. You got mucus on you, too. Okay, are any of you guys got mucus on you? I don't know which one of you is gonna fucking turn. I don't know how the fuck I tell that, either. How the fuck do I tell that? Okay, so they do- they have mucus on them. Mucus, erratic behavior, and... I don't know, do I have a treatment for, for fucking Zucosis? Or is that just an untreatable mental disease? I don't know. Oh yeah, wait, fuck. What am I doing? I need to grab the fecal extractor and uh, put it in. There we go. PC is done. I don't see any wounds on them. They do have mucus all over them. Let's just put the blood in. Apparently that one vial contains all the blood that we uh, gathered. Don't ask me how the fuck that works, but it works. There's only one. Chief's faking. Fuck. Alright. So, Chief is sus. So, he might have a parasite mutant thing. Okay. Retro... Retroviruses. Retroviruses are a group of viruses that cause gastro... gastro... What? Gastro... Neteritis symptoms, including diarrhea, vomiting, and abdominal pain. Okay, that already checks out. Okay, retuitive viruses. Uh, bee guard, maybe? Entricure? Probiotic-based substance for gastrointestinal normalization. Antiseptic substance based on invec... Invectrum. I think it might be this intracure thing. Gastronitrous symptoms include diarrhea, vomiting, and abdominal pain. I don't know. Ah, rotacure. Antiviral substance for treatment of. Ah, retrovirus infections. I see. Create. Create, please. Yes. Okay, we have. 
Retricare. What the fuck? Rescue animal, handle mutant. Ah, Tyrion gorilla! What the fuck? What the fuck? Uh, what do I feed it? What do I feed it? What do I feed it? It said that meat will calm it. Uh, infected. Uh, gorilla. Uh, cook. Uh, herbal. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. I just remembered shit. Fuck. Hold on. Right, food, food, fuck. Get off. No, wait, I did pull it in. I'm an idiot. Uh, god, they're going to die. Uh, cook. Okay, I need to cut one thing off. It said meat will help it, so I'm assuming I have to make this. Okay, good. Uh, fucking cut vegetable. Okay, you want 1.5. I just need to cut off, like, this. I got that exact hell yes. Okay, 1.5 of the meat. This is 3 kilograms, so... It'd be this. 0.9, that's fine. Accept. There we go. Fucking let me out, please. Thank you. Okay, uh, hi, gorilla thing. Please don't kill the others. Please don't be super aggressive. Please don't kill me. Uh. Food. There's food, there's food, there's food. Hi, Mr. Big and Nasty. Okay, what one are you? Hi, there's food, uh. Are you gonna eat? Please calm down. What one are you? I was right, you're a chief. I was right. I was right, it's chief. Okay, pepper? Oh, wait. Okay, okay, pepper? Okay, pepper is fine now. Pepper is fine. Okay, um... I need to shoot Chief with the whatever the fuck I need to cure him. Uh, how the fuck do I cure him? Is my question now. Uh... Okay, what the fuck do I need? Where are the... Oh, here we go. Uh... Oh, wait. Is it the same fucking shit? Hold on. Toxica... Do I just need, like, normal... Experimental substance for eliminating the parasite mimicking plague. What if it's not mimicking anything? What if it's just normal? Because it's not mimicking anything. It's mimicking zucosis, if anything. I mean, I guess it's mimicking what the other one had? Is that what it's doing? I mean, I guess it's supposed to be mimicking that, but it's not... I'm gonna assume it's mimicking this. I'm gonna assume that it's doing the thing where it's just mimicking... Unless there's, like... Is there a disease that does none of them? Okay, I'm gonna assume that it's the same as pepper, so I'm gonna go retrovirus thing. So I need retrovirus toxica. God damn, I need fucking blood. Do I need to actually like extract blood real quick? If so, I guess that makes sense. Okay, so now I know why the hell that is a thing. Thank you for that note, Jesus Christ. God, could you imagine if people didn't find that note? I just thought of that. Oh, God. People who don't pay attention to the notes is good, are fucked. They're just, they're just fucked. Okay, sorry about that, uh, everyone. Uh, fucking people are bothering me about things I don't know where the hell they are. Alright, so I need to get blood from someone who I'm guessing is not Chief. Hi, hey, Chief. Hi. Um, when do you guys want to hold still? No, Pepper, goddammit. One of you hold still. Dexter. Dexter. Hi. I mean, da God damn it. One of you, please hold still. Not Chief, though. Fuck you. I'm not taking your blood. Hi, Pepper. Hi. Thank you for your donation. Sorry about this. Sorry about doing this twice. I just need to heal your friend. <laughs> Hi, Faker. 
All right, I'm assuming I'm gonna have like a little bit of a boss battle here after I have fucking made this cure. All right, so I'm assuming I just don't process it and then I will... Oh my God, can I put this away? There we go. Okay, uh... Retrovard Intoxicant. There we go. Okay, so I make... Oh, it just creates three. Just straight up. Oh, thank you for fucking making three. Jesus Christ. So I'm guessing three is the number I need to cure this thing. I don't know what the hell else it could be mimicking. Oh, hello. Yes, pick up. Yes, give me more meds for later. I don't see anything lying around. Where's Chief? Oh yeah, wait. He'll run if I fucking aim at him directly. Face him away. Face him away. Keep facing away. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, what do I do with that? What do I do with you? It's on the floor there because I poop. Why do I have three of them? I took one. Maybe it takes three if I if you fuck it up. If you're trying to cure it while it's... Actually, yeah, that would make sense. Ugh. Yeah, what the hell? Okay, what do I do with the, th the weird thing on the ground now? Okay, we're gonna move this here. But the God damn it, the dogs are parking. Apologies if you guys can hear it. Oh, God, yeah, okay. I don't know what the fuck. We just made the thing barf it out. Um. Hi, Chief. Good to know you're healthy now. You're all healthy. You're all good. Do I use this to suck this thing up? I'm confused. It's like a... It looks like it's just a poop. But it's... It's a bacterium. Ugh. Okay. So now I have a bacter. Wait. That other side next to the fecal thing. I was wondering what the fuck that was, but I didn't mention it. I thought it would just be like, oh, we have to like pull out a tapeworm or some shit. Because it looks like a tapeworm. But, uh, I think this is what it is, isn't it? Yep. Yep. Please. Please fucking. Please. There we go. It was being weird. Being stuck up. There we go. Okay. Now I have one of those in there. I'm not sure what the fuck this thing is. I'm assuming it went in there. That's the only thing that... This is the only thing that I have access to. And I'm assuming the parasites go in here? It looks like something's back there. I'm assuming this has something to do with the parasites. Assumedly. Not entirely sure. I have no idea. Um, But also... Actually, hold on. Do I have any message? Do I have any notes? Oh, yeah, I do. We've delivered some fresh meat. Head... Oh, God. Head to the hub. Deal with it. Fucking hell. Screw you. I don't like you. Okay, so... We got the thing. We got it out. To the hub. Oh, we're gonna need more meat. That is very true. We're probably gonna need more meat. Uh... So, that's a thing. <laughs> Not sure how to feel about it, uh, but it's a thing. Okay, let's see. Brick trolley, please. Okay, I got rid of one of the veggie bricks. I only have 4 kg left. God. Alright, lever. Okay, please don't scream, Jesus fuck. This one looks mega dead. I, th I think they got it done with this one. Alright, uh... Meet it up, I guess? Ugh. I don't like it. Ah, uh, yes. Meat, totally. Just, just meat. Ugh. Okay, we have been bricked up. Can I please pick it up? Pick it, pick it up. There we go. This is gonna take a while to edit. I can already tell. This is gonna be a very long video. Apologies to everyone watching, but this is going to be a longer video for sure. 
And I'm going to put meat brick on here. Next thing is penguins, and I have fish. So I should be fine, but I am going to grab another fish. Just in case. It... I'm not sure if they always turn. I'm not sure if I have to feed them beforehand. I'm not sure how the hell that works. Uh, but I am going to check something real quick. Uh, do you have anything else to say? No? Nothing else? Is there like meds in here? Is there anything that I can find in here? I'd like some useful stuff, please. No, no, and nothing in here. All right. Let's just move this thing the fuck where it needs to be. Okay, so. So far, this is pretty, this is a pretty interesting game, though. It's pretty nice. I like it. Okay. I'm getting a decent grasp on it. Oh, hey. I didn't realize meds and cures choose. Inspect animals for symptoms. All right. Then again, I have played a number of games that are pretty similar to this type of concept. Alright, so I need... Is that all penguins take as fish, by the way? I didn't think about that. Because penguins are next. Yeah, all I need is fish. Alright, good. Good. Uh, so literally the meat is just for the infected. Alright. Thank God that note exists. Jesus Christ. I feel very sorry for whoever does not find that note. Because it's not like it was easy to find. I literally had to go off the beaten track to locate the goddamn thing. Warning! Bio waste filter is clogged. What the fuck? Clean the bio waste filter. Alright. Uh, okay. The fuck is there a hand? Wait. Why can't I pick severed hand? This feels like... Is this the severed hand from SCP Container Breach? Like, the fuck? Severed hand added. I have no notes on that? Okay. Uh, just the severed hand. That is all it is. Um, can I get rid of these? Experimental substance for eliminating the parasite mimicking retrovirus. Alright. Well, I already got rid of that parasite. I guess. Is there a reason I have a severed hand? Is the... Wait, there's a hand scan... There was a hand scanner in here, wasn't there? I saw it out of the corner of my eye. I didn't bother interacting with it. Biometrical lock. Oh my god, we can... We can go here. Damn, okay, where's... Is there... Is this where I can find the missing tool? The fuck? Okay. What? The actual fuck? Who are you? Dr. Oliver Metzger. What a surprise. Doc really turned out to be a doctor. Well. Ooh. And apparently he knows that we're down here. Fun. Um, hi. I know it's you. Son of a bitch. Hey, take it easy, Paul Connolly. <laughs> What's going on? Like you don't know, you bastard. You think just because I'm poor... I don't have to don't answer his calls. You infected me with some crap and expect me to die like the animals in your fucking zoo? <laughs> Shut up! You think I wouldn't figure it out, Dr. Oliver Metzger? You said there was no lab here. So why the hell am I standing in one talking to you now? Oh, Paul, what the fuck? Here you go again. Your ass shouldn't be where you are right now. This is a restricted area, not related to the zoo or your duties. And yes, I did inject you with a parasite, but not to harm you, rather to protect you. Without it, your job would be much <laughs> harder. <laughs> the fuck? If you use your head and get through the first night properly, I'll come back in the morning and remove it. You'll get your money after the first shift, and no one will get hurt. Just finish what you started. It's almost over, Paul. <laughs> okay. Asshole! You think I'll believe a word you say after this? <laughs> You'll have to, Paul. <laughs> You're locked in. And I'm the only one who can open the door. 
Plus, I've got an NDA signed by your own hand right in front of me. I'm just offering you a way out of this tricky situation, Paul. The choice is yours. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll be back soon. Finish what the, the fuck? Job. Okay. Okay, he's a little demented. Just, just a little. Oh, cell phone. Oh, it's my cell phone. Oh, shit. Yes, call Lily. Jesus Christ. Stop her from eating that meat, please. Hello? Paul, is that you? You said they took your phone. Yes, my dear. I found where they hid it. Lily, please tell me you haven't eaten the meat. Yes, please. Jesus Christ, what please. What are you talking about, Paul? We just had dinner recently. It was incredibly delicious. Gina was simply in awe. No. Fuck. Fuck. No! I don't want to hear anything about it. If there's anything left, throw it away immediately. Paul! Paul, what's wrong? You're scaring me. Just do as I ask. No time to explain. I'll be back in the morning and I'll tell you everything. Well, that's fucked. Alright. Noted, noted. Um, What the fuck's this? It seems they cause mutations in humans as well as animals. That's the only thing I got a question. Not the fucking giraffe with spider legs. Is that thing the mouth's in the ass of the zebra? What the fuck? <laughs> also, we kind of knew that. You're infected, buddy. Damn. Most likely all the information is stored on external drives. Without them, this computer is just an empty shell. That's kind of how floppy disks work, buddy. I can insert the floppy disk. Damn. Am I supposed to be a hacker? Without a password, this floppy disk is useless. I can't do anything here without help. Okay, noted. Um, diplomas? Looks like Miss Summers was right to be worried about her husband. Oh my god, it was his hand. It was his fucking hand. Wait. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. 5-5 five, five, slash 1. Oh, am I not allowed to type at all? Oh, that's fucking great. Ah, damn it. Let's go try and guess the password. Fucker. Alright, alright. Fair, I guess. I guess it was for something else. Perhaps. I'm not sure. Either way. Let us continue, I guess. We investigated. We didn't find anything. It's fine, I guess. Fucking... Let's get the hell out of here, I guess. We have all the stuff we need. So to the penguins we go. Onward to the penguins! Let's see some penguins. I'm hyped to see some penguins. Task updated. Nice. Oh, literally just check the enclosure and shit. Alright, fair. Now, let's see. Uh, first, we feed the penguins. A 2.0 out of 6. Okay, so if this is 6... Then it be not that. Like here? I think. 1.9. Literally one off. Are you shitting me? So fucking close. God fucking damn it. Alright. Um Well, we all know the drill. Pull the lever crunk. Alright, let's see. Um Anything lying around over here? No, nope, not seeing it. I still want to know what the missing thing is. Because there is still a missing bit. There's a missing tool. Why the fuck's that door open? I haven't been here. Why the fuck's this door open? Okay, well, I get the chemicals. I guess. Uh, Where's the missing tool, though? Is it in here? Or is it for later in the game? Where's the missing tool? There is a missing tool. Maybe this PDA will tell me? Okay, his last... His last, uh... PDA entry. Okay. Damn, something strange is happening to me. An overwhelming urge to eat this raw meat. My hand grabbed a piece on its own. And I devoured it almost without chewing. That sweet taste in my mouth. That's fucked. Okay. Um... The fuck? Uh, so he's turning. That's fun. Is that what's happening to my character? Is that it? 
Am I gonna be driven mad by this thing? Still a missing instrument on my wagon. Bothering me. You said that there's stuff hidden? Maybe I have to go to the other enclosures at some point. I don't know how long this game is. But I do want to get through the four animals that we have access to now, and I'm guessing we'll get access to the other ones later? Question mark? Dear God, how many of these are there? One, two, three, four, five, six. There's six of them. Jesus Christ. Okay, we have Daisy, Luna, Coco, Tinker, Misty, and Rocky. All right, let's see the penguins. I want to see the penguins. I'm terrified of when they turn, but... Oh my God, they're adorable. Oh, they have the multicolor patterns. Uh, These are emperor penguins, I think. They have like a multicolor pattern sometimes. Hi, Tinker. Hi, can I pet you? Oh my God, you're adorable. I should have pet the other animals, but I... Uh, the penguins. The penguins. Hold on, guys. I'll feed you. Hold on. I know that's what you're here for. That's why you're here. Come on. Doing a rocky. Hello. Get fed. That does not look like what I made. Why is it slop? I missed the... Oh, you have green. Oh, Luna has blue. That's sick. Oh, you have purple. Oh, that's cool. All right. I love that they have the little neck things, because I know that can happen, like, naturally. In nature, they can have, like, different neck bit things going on. I don't know what causes it, but it just kind of happens. Okay. One of yous. Okay, Luna is warm. The rest of you are fine. Okay, please tell me that's the only thing you have, and then I can just use Temporalax. I hope that's the only thing you have. I don't see you acting erratically, so you don't seem to have Zucosa symptoms. There we go. Let's just get the poop. You guys have weird-looking poop. Then again, it is bird poop. It makes sense. What the fuck is that? Oh, is that you guys? Is that you guys pooping? That is a sound. Oh, hey. Oh, you guys have a little pond entrance. Oh. There we go. Okay, I've done it like four times, five. Is that all the poops? Did I get all your poops? I lost track of how much I collected. Hi, Rocky. I think I got you all. I think I got two that last one as well. Unless one of you wanders over here to do it. I seem to just wander off then to shit somewhere. I do not see any more, so I'm assuming that I have it all. Nope, there it is. I almost missed you. Okay, we're gonna put that there. Jesus Christ, that is full. Okay, blood syringe. Okay, I, they were all going over here, so I'm assuming they're all taking a nap or sitting. Yes, okay. I don't mind me, Misty. Yeah, I got Misty's blood. Note. Mental note, Misty is done. Rocky. I right, sorry to interrupt your nap. Okay, Rocky is done. Coco. Coco is done. Okay. I have Misty, Rocky, Coco. And who are you? Daisy. I have Misty, Rocky, Coco, and Daisy. I just need the other two, since one of them walked away. Hi. Who are you? Tinker. Don't think I've, you haven't gotten your blood now. One more. There's Misty. I got yours. Rocky, Tinker, Daisy, Luna. Luna, I have not gotten your blood. Please stop walking, Luna. Tinker. Thank you, Tinker. I just need a little blood sample. It'll be okay. You'll be fine. Okay, Luna. Hello. Literally, I have a cat named Luna, so I'm surprised. So, I would not be surprised. So, I'm not, I'm not gonna start calling for Luna, actually, because otherwise I'm gonna get my cat instead, and she's napping on her cat tree. <laughs> okay, I've gotten, I think, everyone's blood, unless I miscounted or lost track of who the fuck I've taken from. So now, now I pull out this, and I get some sound readings. 
Hi, Tinker. I haven't gotten any readings other than the one. And I think... Where are you? It was not Daisy. It was not Tinker. It was... Are you Luna? Luna is sick. Oh, poor Luna. Task complete. That's all of them. Okay. I hope Luna just has fucking one symptom. That'll be much easier. I know where Templar I know where Temper relaxes. Did I put that? No, don't take. Now exit enclosure. Now I have a sneaking suspicion that one of them is emulating the other. Oh wait, you know what I should probably fucking do? Because I can figure out who's trying to emulate things. And it's faking it. Because they don't have the symptoms, but they're acting like the other. So, if I do this... Because Luna isn't displaying any symptoms, it would seem. But she has mucus on her. Like, Rocky has mu mucus on him. And she has mucus on her. Ah, Rocky. Rocky, Rocky, Rocky. Are you a little sus boy? I am suspecting Rocky of being an infected. So that's interesting. So you can actually suss them out. You just have to take the extra steps. That is interesting. All right. Got a fun little mechanic. You got to like investigate. Figure out who's going to be the infected one. And since there's going to be an infected one, I'm going to immediately make the food. Once we get back here. Because something tells me they don't turn until after I make the cure. And I think the best way to do it is make the food, feed them, and then... And then get them all sorted. We're going to deposit the blood samples. And that task's completed. Good. Okay, now. What do infected... Penguins need. Okay, I can cook that easy. Okay, you want 1.5 out of 4.1. That'd be about here. One point one, alright, alright. Acceptable. Okay, weird meat brick. You want one one kilogram out of five point one. Okay, we're gonna go here. And that works! Except, we have the meats! Okay, we're good. Okay, I don't know how the fuck we not have the temporal relax shit. Okay, so, Rocky's the sus one. Rocky's a little sus boy. Oh. Temporal relax. RTIs, respiratory tract infection, uh, or viral, are viral or bacterial infections affecting the nose, throat, sinus, and airway lungs. Ah, so literally, Luna just has the temporal X shit. So I just need to make one of those. Give me a temporal X, please. Thank you. Num three. Three. Do I? Do I have to push numlock? Hold on. <laughs> I'm gonna load this shit I don't need. And I'm just gonna fire it off into the ground. Because why the fuck not? I don't need it anymore. It's not useful to me. I can make more later. There's a go. Yep, I was correct. It's infected. And he's turned. Hi, Rocky. Hi, uh, please don't kill anyone. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill anyone else. Okay, dump food. Dump food. Come on. Come on. Come on, Rocky. Your food is here. No. No, don't kill anyone. Hi. Are you Rocky? Did I guess correctly? We'll find out. God, you're weird. I was correct, it's Rocky. It is Rocky. Okay. Um... I have a correct guess. 
Now, let's go treat Luna real quick. While we're here. Luna, are you sleeping now? Daisy, ah, there she is. Oh, I didn't load the fucking temporal relax. I was gonna say. Wait, why do I not see- I was gonna say, why do I not see the syringe in the gun? There we go. Temporal relax, treated, there we go. Okay. Oh, fuck, I forgot to take the blood syringe as well. I'll be right back. I just need to grab the blood syringe. I need to grab some animal blood real quick. That's not too bad to learn. Okay, it really... I like how it's not holding my hand, really. And it's, like, letting me figure shit out for my fucking self. I missed you. Rocky, I'm not taking your blood. Fuck off. You're infected. Tinker, hi. Don't mind me, Tinker. I'm just going to take some of your blood. You won't mind, do you? Thank you. Okay, so... I need to get the one that's mimicking the temporal X thing. Okay, so it mimics the symptoms, but it doesn't mimic all of them, which is interesting. Okay. Temporal X, temporal X, temporal X, temporal X. Where's the one that mimics temporal X? Hold on. RTI. Is there one that says RTI? I don't see one that says temporal X. Elegenerax. Am I dumb? Thosticus Felicis. Making Plague. Making Rotary Virus. Respiratory Viral Infection. No, rep Respiratory Tract Infection. Making Sepsis. Making Leptricity. Making. How do I figure out what it's mimicking? Oh, acute respiratory viral infections. Oh. This is a viral or bacterial infection affecting nose, throat, and airways and lungs. So that's respiratory. So it'd be this one. All right. All right, all right. Noted, noted. Yeah, I'll get that in a second. Hold the fuck on. Just put this away. And pull out the gun. Well, I need to arm my gun. And now to give Rocky his medicine. Hopefully this works. I don't have to boss fight him. Coco. There's Luna. There's Misty. There's Rocky. Oh my god, it worked. Ooh. Okay, so yeah, really just be behind them. Do not let them see you. I think. Either that or I just... If you get the thing right, it doesn't do the boss fight thing. I've heard of boss fights. What? These don't feel like boss fights. Maybe I'm doing things correctly? I'm not sure. Dear, dear God. Oh, it's also toggle run. Interesting. Put, pick up. Okay, let's go give her get ourselves a a pathogen a thingy. I'm not sure what to call it. Okay, there we go. I have gotten the thing. I will now put the thing into the thing. Oh my god, E E. There we go. Fucking hell. That is... Some of the spots are a little weird, but I think it's just because there's so many ones there. Okay, there we go. I have two of them. And there's only been two, so... I'm just gonna assume I'm good. I don't know what ending I'm gonna get. If I'm gonna get an ending, maybe it'll just continue. Does this end after four? I'm not sure. I'm not entirely sure how the fuck this works. I mean, I'm understanding the basic stuff, because I've played a lot of games with similar mechanics. Oh, fuck. Oh, my friend, time to see how you fare during your probation. Hi, Doc. What the fuck? You're doing great. The other subjects have been paralyzed for an hour by this point. You probably noticed that the creatures haven't bothered you. It's 
all thanks to the parasite. Now we just need to decide whether to remove it from you or not. I am sorry, Paul. Mother is against it. Seems she's very hungry. She only eats what she kills herself. Oh, what the f fuck you? Oh, that's fucked. All right. Oh, God. What the fuck is that thing? It was just hands. Was it the, weren't those the hands from the trailer, though? Paul didn't save the journalist, thanks to his call to Lily. She didn't go to the police and remained safe and sound. But Paul couldn't escape the dark zoo's walls becoming food for the mo monsters. Oh. So there's a synopsis at the end. Okay. New animal is available. Zebra. Oh, we can go to the zebras. Okay. But, wait, the game ended. Wait. New animal is available. Moose. New animal is available. Hippos. Okay. Elephants! Yes, I want to go see the elephants. Damn. Oh. New game and new game plus. Oh. Okay, alright. So this is like one of those games that just says new game plus and then continues onwards. And I'm guessing that's how you get all the other endings that are advertised. <laughs> because literally on the on the store page it says there's like tons of endings. Okay, it feels like there's so many options. So, I wonder if I could not give my wife the meat. Or maybe give her the fish. Maybe give her the fish. I don't know. But that'll be for, like, next time. I wonder... I'm just wondering how deep the fucking choices are. Because I mentioned, like, every choice, almost. I'm assuming the journalist is the person I ch chucked into the meat grinder? I'm not sure. Anyway, uh, yeah, this, this is Ucosis. Uh, this is the first episode, I guess. Uh, apparently, we're going to be playing more. Uh, I, didn't, I didn't expect it. But, yeah, this is this is a fun game. I'm definitely going to be playing the rest of this. Anyway, I hope everyone has enjoyed. If you should join the ranks of the SCP Foundation, don't shoot the like button, slay those comments, and contain the subscribe button. Anyway, guys, I'll see you in the next video, live stream, or whatever the next. Peace, guys.